to my beautiful wife. My goodness, you look stunning tonight. <laughs> what a lucky man I am. Wash me not white as snow. On this incredibly special occasion, in this beautiful place, we are gathered in your name, Lord. We thank you for the beautiful surroundings and for this festive opportunity to gather as family and friends. One day, we were at a wedding in America. She was sat at a table with all these bright young things who worked in Washington for the government, and she realized that her career was limited without a degree. She decided to go to university. Fortunately, she chose to go to the Royal Agricultural University at Sorencester, because if she hadn't, she wouldn't have met Anton. memories of nights out at Dukes and New Year's parties of always making it to the end, clearing dance floors and ending up with a romantic sunrise chuffed with our efforts. <laughs> and possibly fate ensured that you got to Siren and those Mvurachina default dance moves made sure that only the right person would see through it and see the diamond in the rough. <laughs> Now, Chloe knew her employment opportunities in Germany would be very limited, but she went with Anton anyway. But I think you'll all agree with me that this young couple were lucky to have found each other. They'll be able to conquer whatever challenges they face, and inevitably there's going to be a few, but Chloe and Anton will overcome them as a team. Gather up your garden stones and take them to the wall. I give you this ring as a symbol of my love and faithfulness as I place it on your finger I commit my heart and soul to you I ask you to wear this ring as a reminder of the vows we took today Heavenly Father, we thank you for this union and we ask you to bless these two young people. May they be a safe place where friends and family can come and feel loved. Bless this union, bless their marriage and be with them. Ladies and gentlemen, my beautiful wife, hey, hey. and I would like to welcome you and thank you for joining us on this special day. It's awesome to see you, Anton, and your new bride, Chloe, so happy, and I'm, I'm glad this day is working out so well so far, and I'm sure it'll only take off and get better. Uh, uh, it's been dreamlike being here in New Zealand um, with this amazing scenery and it's such a super location to share this special time with you guys. There's also some poetic justice for a short person with big fluffy feet coming here with a ring so close to Hobbiton. <laughs> it's been amazing to watch you progress and succeed in life. Keep up your drive to succeed and I have no doubts that you'll be able to look after your new wife and future family. I'm super chuffed for you and Chloe, you're definitely punching above your weight there, Antoine. <laughs> and uh, I wish you guys all the best for what the future will bring you. Chloe and I met during the first year at the Royal Agricultural College in Siren Sister. We started off just as mates, as Chloe thought my short hair and small malnourished Zimbabwe arms would not handle a kiwi from the South Island. During the summer break, she went off to sell cars and I had to grow her hair and muscles while farming. 
On return to uni with said hair and muscles, let's just say the kiwi from the South Island was easily tamed. <laughs> that smile of yours lights up a room. You're kind, loving, all round 10 out of 10. I couldn't ask for more. I love you, Clay. Ladies and gentlemen, be upstanding to say a toast to my beautiful wife as we go together into the future to love, laughter and happily ever after. <laughs>